Hey guys, Marcus Manus. We got three products from Olight today to take a look at. They sent me these out, so I didn't buy these. So I'm going to market pay promotion, but I don't work for Olight. They don't pay me to make these videos. And even if you click the link in the description and use the code MM10, you can save 10% on certain items. But even if you do that, I'm not an affiliate with them. I don't make any money off that, but it might let them know I'm the one that sent you there if you click the link and maybe they'll send me even more free stuff. Maybe that's the way that it works. I'm not real sure. But I'm just letting you know, even though really all I'm going to do is go over features, these aren't a review because they're brand new to me. Uh, I, it's not a biased thing where I'm pushing you to buy these things. You buy them if they work for you. You don't. That's the way I am with all my tool reviews. I just give you how I use things, how I think they are a good fit for certain things, and you can make the choice for yourself. But we've got three products that they sent me out that we're going to take a look at today. And again, I'm going to put in the description everything that the Olight representative sent me about the sale that's going on because you can get one of these for free. Uh, the other ones are on sale for certain prices. Everything they sent me is going to be in the description. Make sure and check that out and see if any of these things are the fit for you. But let's go ahead and look at these. So the first product that they sent me is an i3e EOS mono output keychain LED flashlight. They've sent me many of these in the past. You can see a couple of other colors back there. This is the thing that they kind of give away free sometimes during their sales just by logging in. And you can see the I Olight i3e EOS runs off a AAA battery. I'll put all the specs on the back of the box. I'll put a picture of the back of the box up here so you can look at it. But it's essentially the same light we've looked at many times. Mono output. You turn it on by turning the lever or turning the flashlight handle here and once it tightens up it makes connection with that battery turns it on i'm not even going to show you the light output in the dark it's just decent enough it's a little keychain light uh, maybe you collect these because they've got so many colors maybe that's something somebody does or maybe you know somebody in your life that just loves uh, christmas time or winter time they love snowflakes and this is something that they'd like to have on their keychain uh, that's something that you could get for them. So that's the I3E EOS. Next up, they sent me an O knife. It's the O Tackle KI multifunction knife. There's some of the specs on the box if you want to check those out. But it's essentially just a all-in-one type knife. It's very small. You can see it there in my hand. If we take a measurement on it to give you that idea, it's about two and three quarter, somewhere around in that range long, by roughly probably about seven eighths of an inch wide, uh, pretty thin. But it's got three different blades on it. It's got your scissors. If you open those up, you've got some scissors there that you can use. It also has your standard blade that can open up and you can use that as well. And then it also has a multi-purpose blade with kind of like a slotted screwdriver type end. Also, you could use that to pry open maybe paint cans or something. However, it's not real thick. I think if you open up a new paint can, that's probably going to be okay if you've got one that's got paint sealed all the way around it i don't know if you're going to be able to get into that or not but also have uh you know bottle cap openers things like that so multi-use knife this one's normally going to run you i think 20 dollars 1999 msrp i think during this sale they're going to have it on for 16 bucks so uh, that's the o tackle ki their big sale item during this sale is going to be the arc flex light i think they have an arc failed i think that's what it's called arc field arc failed it looks just like this if you look up pictures of it you're not going to really be able to distinguish it, but this has a big difference in the feature that it has. You can see those arrows there. This one has a 90 degree rotating head, so it goes anywhere between there and 90 degrees down. You can stop it midway if you want to. That's the big difference on this one, and this one normally is going to run you $80 when they put it to market, but during this sale, they've got 30% off, so you can get it for $56. And again, it's a small, compact light. It's real slim. I like the thinness of it. I like how thin it is instead of being one of those bulky or cylinder type lights uh, measurements wise if i measure the length of it here it's right around four and a quarter width wise you're maybe a little over an inch and an eighth maybe an inch and three sixteenths and then thickness wise if you don't count the clip you're looking at right around five eighths inch thickness so pretty small pretty compact i think it's going to be a pretty useful light for many people and again that that articulating head is really nice because yeah, i can put it on my hat I could wear this one as a hat clip and it's definitely not too heavy of a light to be able to do that I, some of them are too heavy this one's heavier than maybe some of the ones you might normally use but it's not too heavy you can still use it for that but now with that flex head if i'm looking forward but maybe what i'm working on is kind of down just a little bit i have the ability to make the adjustment and slowly move that down get my light exactly where i want it to be or even a bigger bonus is i can take this out of my hat now Put it in my shirt pocket, 
turn that 90 degrees and now I've got a front facing light that's going to allow me to walk and to see in front of me. I think, again, I think that that is such a nice feature uh, to add to any light uh, along with that magnetic base. Whenever you put that on there, that's where it gets even better because how many of you have been working in a situation and wherever the metal is, I just can't get my light. So my metal's here, but I really want to light up this space. Well, now I can either light up this way or I can turn that and then also get it in another direction if I want to and even spin this light to whichever direction I need it to to be able to get it there because the Milwaukee light that I like to use a lot a lot of times it's got magnets in different places that will allow me to do certain things but again it's not articulating so my light is only going to go this way by using that magnet there there's no way for me to kind of turn it out this way towards myself like I can with this arc flex uh, just by moving it that way so that's the big benefit to me of that flexible head i think that's probably what makes this one a little bit more beneficial than maybe the regular version so features wise again you got the articulating head to 90 degrees you also get a magnetic base so it's magnetic like i just showed you they do supply you with one of their magnetic chargers it slaps on there pretty easy i do like these chargers that just plugs into any usb outlet or wall block or whatever you've got this is all you get in the box you don't get the wall block uh, it has the on off button over here on the side uh, it's pretty easy to get to also has that battery indicator there that lights up and lets you know exactly how much battery you have you can turn that on and off uh, it also has five light settings along with strobe mode i'm going to put the back of the box picture up here so you can see what type of battery what kind of lumens what kind of throw all those things that way i don't have to sit here and try to memorize those and share them with you there's the back of the box you can pause it and look at it if you want to but essentially, you can hold down the on button for a couple seconds. That's going to put you in that moonlight mode, very small light. And as you keep holding it down, it just gets a little bit brighter. There's low, there's medium, there's high. And now to double press it to get into turbo mode. And then triple press will get you into that strobe mode. But now let me show it to you in the dark here. So we'll start by pressing and holding the button for two seconds. That's going to get you into that moonlight mode. Again, it's going to be a little bit brighter than what you're seeing right here as far as what I can see on the screen. It's enough for you to be able to walk around and not draw a lot of attention to yourself. Press and hold it down. We're going to go to low. Uh, you can see it lights up pretty good. Press and hold it again. There's medium. Now we'll go into high. That's pretty much lighting up everything in front of me. I can see it very easily. And then now again, we're going to press it three times and get into that turbo, or press it twice real fast, get into turbo mode. Uh, and that lights up 100% around me. That's that full max capacity on the lumens. And then again, you can triple click it and get into that strobe mode. So yeah, guys, that's the three products that Olight sent me out this time uh, in preparation for their Christmas sale going on from the 11th through the 16th. Uh, again, one of those you can possibly get for free. Just go check out. You probably have to go to their website and see if that's possible. But this ArcFlex seems like a pretty nice light to me. Let me know in the comments below what you think about it. If you think that it would be useful uh, for you and your line of work, let us know that below. Hope that this was useful in some way. Hope it helps you out. Hope it even maybe saves you some money. That's always a good thing too. But you guys stay safe. Have a blessed day. And I'll see you on the next video.